So what's actually happening when a trained fighter lands cleanly? Let's break it down. So we need to talk about pressure, PSI. Fighters hit around 800 PSI, heavyweight boxers up to 1700. Untrained guys, about 150. So what about force? Newtons, amateurs, around two and a half thousand. Elites, over 5,000. That's like swinging a baseball bat at full force. Then we have energy, joules. Most punches fall between 100 to 450 joules. The best can crack at 1,000. That's like dropping a bowling ball off a second story building onto someone's face. Now, the head can take a lot of punishment but a series of heavy punches that can generate up to 75 Gs. That's concussion territory. And what about bones? Skulls can fracture at 5.1 kN of force. Ribs at 3,300 Newtons. A femur, the strongest bone in the human body, that will crack at 4,000 Newtons. So yes, a punch can definitely break bone. The reason it doesn't happen every fight is the padding on the gloves and the skull's natural curvature. 